fix up this top. This top is um, wet sanded. You can see uh, it's got a uh, light, like a satin finish. Taking a 2000 grit paper to it to get all the orange peel off and now I'm going to buff it. Bring it, oops, sorry about that. Bring it up to a good, nice luster. What we're using is uh, medium cut Meguiar's mirror glaze. It's number seven. So it's, it's a heavy cut, relatively heavy cut. And I'm using a quarter cable oscillating sander, uh, DA sander. surface paint. Come on, Regan. I put my sneakers on and immediately think we're going. Oh. We're not going anywhere, Regan. We're working. Okay, so I'm gonna show you the before and after. So that's that. And that's that. Okay. I'll get this down here. Let me bring this around so you can see in the glare what this does. The first thing I did was use here's here's what the what it looked like. It's real high gloss. This hasn't been done yet. It's a little dusty, but you can see it's real high high gloss. And I took 2,000 grit paper and wet sand at this. So here's the, f this is what it looked like before, kind of, kind of dull. And you can see there's some shiny spots. That's the, what was initially sprayed. See those shiny spots where there's little grooves that the grit, the 2000 grit didn't get into. So this is what it looks like after doing it. It's baby smooth after buffing it. This is before the buff, just 2000 grit paper to cut the orange peel. And that's after. I don't know if you can see my hand, but here it's much glossier. And it's real smooth. So I'll hit this again, and the, as the more times I do it, I'll bring it up. Bring it up to a fine, nice shine. That's, that's probably a good angle right there, as a matter of fact. You can see the glossy, and you can see it's dull. So, and that's the part I just, I just did. That's what buffing does. You can do it by hand. You don't need any special tools. The, the special tool you need is the cut, is the cleaner. This is uh, just a polish. It's not a wax. 
It's just a polish. It's got very fine abrasives in it. And those abrasives will, as you rub them in, the crystal will break down and they cut right into the surface of the paint, smoothing it out. Alright, well the camera got a good polish, that's for sure. I'll take this off. Okay, so that's how that's how you do it. And you can see there's a nice cloud. There's a pretty cloud floating by right in the in the surface. So Alright, that's how I do it.